it's Kate and today I'm going to be doing um eating one color for 24 hours um I haven't chosen a color yet but I have um I'll show you all the colors so you know I'm not cheating red orange blue black purple brown yellow pink and white and green and i really the color that i want so i think i want yellow because then i'll be able to have pasta and eggs which i'm i don't like it that much but i mean i have them a lot and then i'd be able to have like banana um smoothie i guess all right but um so i put them all in a hat and um, make sure you guys like, subscribe, and by the time you see me for breakfast, I'll be a little more waking up because it's very early right now. But as you can see, they're all folded. I'm even gonna wear a blindfold so I can't cheat. I'll wear a tight one. Please don't be green, okay? I'll see you in first. Do I see the right way or the wrong way? It is red! Okay, um... What am I gonna eat that is red? Bye. Hey guys, so I am ready to do breakfast and and I put on a bed. People we'll usually go out and buy a bunch of red stuff. But we were actually in quarantine where we live, so we're just kind of using what we have, which is okay. It's kind of like a little block here, but very good us. But it will be okay. Alright, so we bought this, and I know milk isn't red.
so they are now just a little bit more chocolate. I'm gonna cheat a little bit more vanilla because overall the whole smoothie will be red because vanilla is more of a brown color. That's a lot of vanilla. But it won't change the color and then milk is like the base of our smoothie. Um, and I don't have strawberry milk. So I'm just going to use the milk again. It'll be red. And I chose myself a very hard meal. Oh my gosh, perfect. We've got cranberry juice. Yeah, water is, obviously, you can drink water. Um, Not pour a lot of milk. I like my smoothies more runny, so I pour about that much milk. It's looking pretty good. And then now we are just going to blend it. Which I am very scared for because last time my sister blended something, and we blended it too long, and it exploded out of the thing. What I usually do with my smoothies is I just kind of shake them so the milk gets like everywhere around. And then we will blend it. Three, two, one. Oh my gosh, it's not working. Hold up. It's pretty pink to me, and I think it is done. So now I'm just going to cut it in a cup, and I will see you guys when I'm about to drink it. Bye. A few moments later. Okay, guys. So I have finished the pink smoothie and plated it, and now I'm going to taste it. Ooh. Ooh. It kind of tastes good, but then that hint of like vanilla just like comes in really strong. Um, it's all right, but that's my meal, and I'll show you guys when I am almost done and see how much of this that I can drink, and then I will see you guys at lunchtime. Okay, guys, so this is all that I could drink, and I will see you guys at lunchtime. Bye. Hey guys, it's Kate, and I am back for lunch. And I'm going to be making, um, if you kind of skip through the breakfast a little bit, it's only eating red food for 24 hours. So I'm going to make a quesadilla. Um, I'm going to put you guys right there. There we go. Okay, so I have this, which I'm going to cut in half um, because it's really big. So I'm just going to push it right there and just cut it. Those are so uneven, but it's okay. Like really, really uneven. Alright, now we've got two. And what I'm gonna do, and this is a red wrap. It's kind of oranges, but it's red. It's not hot. Okay, so I'm gonna get some butter. It's on high, I think. But I'm gonna get some butter. And this is as red as I can get. Some of it's like orangish, yellowish, but we're in Corona, so I can't go to the store like in the challenge you normally go to the store and pick out a bunch of red stuff. So we actually just have to use what we have at home. So that's why some of the stuff is cheating a little bit. Like the butter isn't red. Um, but yeah, 
And then I'm gonna put some popcorn chicken from Publix, which is like kind of like an orangish more, but it's we're we're going orange and red, so it'll be okay. But I'm just gonna melt the butter on it. And this is gonna be a series, so if you guys like it, then I will do more because it's fun. Right, but I'm going to get one slice and just kind of press it down. Um, I barely ever make quesadillas, like ever. So I'm not the best at making them or really even knowing how to make them. But I think it, uh, I think you're meant to roast the tortilla for a little bit before you actually like do anything. And I change into red bottoms because I did my workout. Um, I was getting too hot to wear leggings, so I changed and to red pants that I forgot I had. All right, so it sounds like it's sizzled. I'm not the best cook, but I would say I'm pretty good at it. So it smells good. All right, so now I'm going to add the cheese. Right, so this is a comparison before and after. It gets more red when it cooks, which is good. This is provolone cheese. It's not super red, it's kind of more yellow, but it's okay for what we got. Oh no, all these air bubbles are coming in. No, get out. And you guys can follow this along and cook with me. But I think I'm just going to get two slices of cheese. Hot. My dog is like, give me the food. And then I'm gonna put the chicken in. Little tiny bits of chicken. I know it's falling. It's hot though, like really hot. Be careful when you make this, if you make this, because it's hot. All right, so now I'm, I think I'm gonna add red onion and some hot sauce. I don't like tomato a lot, so I'm just going to cut a little. Okay. So I've got the tomato. Ooh, it is dripping. And this is very messy. So I'm going to go ahead and turn the heat down for a little bit. Comment down below if you like tomatoes. But I think Come oh, my doggy. Do you want it? She's standing here. Every time I cook. I'm always cooking with a little person standing next to me. Oh, it's dripping with my fingers. Like, actually, like, hey, we don't have food for you. We do not. But she always loves the food. So now I'm just going to cut a little tomato. Because tomato is red. And I was thinking, I was like, oh, I don't want to dip this in ketchup, but ketchup's the only thing that's red. And I was like, salsa. But I'm just gonna put some tomato there. I feel like I completely charred the back of this. Okay. 
tomatoes warm in there. Okay, but now we throw the rest away. And these little pet season it a little. Some garlic salt. And we will put the other top on. going to be a very defined quesadilla, like messed up, but right there is the quesadilla, and it is done, and I will see you guys when I'm ready to eat it. Alright, so I've got my red quesadilla with some salsa and sour cream, and I will see you guys at snack time, so bye for now! Alright, so a quick update, I ate all of my quesadilla, and I will see you guys at snack time, which I think is going to be a red popsicle, um, because a while ago I made popsicles that were layered red, um, so I will see you guys at snack time. Bye! Okay guys, so I just got out of the pool, and I'm going to have a red snack and a popsicle, and I will see you when it is out of its mold, so bye. All right, so I know not all of it's pink, but some of it is a reddish pinkish at the bottom, so that's all the part that I'll eat, and then I will see you at dinner time. Oh, and guys, um, I forgot to vlog this, but I'm super sorry that it's coming to you very late. I'll try to do it the day before and then post it in the morning. Um, I'm sorry, um, but I also forgot to say I've been drinking some cranberry juice, which is also red, and I will officially see you at dinner, so. Cheers. Okay guys, so it is now dinner time and I got some corn dogs and apples. Um, on the outside it's not red, but it is on the inside. And I hope you guys found that um, 24 hours eating challenge fun and um, like it if you wanna see more and I will see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.